Hello everyone, I'm Mr. Garden Projects, and today I'm going to be making a figure about how to make an insect hotel. What we're going to need for today is 650cm, 7.5cm by 7.5cm piece of wood, which I've got here. 150cm, 7.5cm by 7.5cm piece of wood, which I've got here. A drill with a crosshead bit on it, which I've got there. A 7.5mm drill bit, which I've got there. An 8mm drill bit, which I've got there. Tape measure which I've got here, ruler which I've got here, pencil which I've got here, and 10 100mm wood screws which I've got here. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to screw the bottom piece of wood and the two side pieces of wood together. I'm going to line them both up and now I'm going to screw them into place. Now they're both lined up, we're going to screw them into place. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to screw the three centre pieces of wood into place. What I'm going to do first is I'm going to make two marks, three centimetres from the inside of the two side pieces of wood along the bottom piece of wood. Now I've done that, I'm going to line up two of the centre pieces of wood on the outside edge with my three centimetre mark. I'm going to do the same on both sides. Now I've done that, I'm going to screw them into place. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to make two three and a half centimetre marks from the inside of the two centre pieces of wood along the bottom piece of wood. Now I've done that, I'm going to line up the centre piece of wood. When this piece of wood is into place, like so, I'm going to screw it into place. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to spin my framework 
around. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to screw the 50 centimetre, 7.5 centimetre by 7.5 centimetre arrow rail into place. I'm going to screw the two side bits into place first. I'm just going to line the side bit on the arrows rail, and the other side bit of the arrows rail. Up with the sides like so. I'm nice in place. I'm going to screw it into place. Now I've done that, my framework should look like this. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to make two three, three centimetre marks from the inside of the two solid pieces of wood. Now I've done that, I'm going to line two of the centre pieces of wood up with my marks and when I've done that, like so, I'm going to screw them into place. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to make two three and a half centimetre marks from the inside of the two centre pieces of wood and on the top piece of wood. Now I've done that, I'm going to line the centre piece of wood up with my marks and now I'm going to screw it into place. Now I've done that, I'm going to screw the centre piece of wood into place. Now I've done that, why is it hotel shoe like this? As you can see, Three centre pieces of wood with all the holes in. In the centre piece of wood, I drilled 34 holes with an 8mm drill bit all the way through, and with the other two centre pieces of wood, I drilled 34 holes with a 7.5mm drill bit all the way through. The holes I've seen attract mason bees, solitary bees, 
and other insects in the garden or allotment or wherever you put up your insects hotel. I hope you liked my video about how to manage an insect hotel. Please like, comment and subscribe. Thanks for watching.